Assalamu alaikum, how are you all? Hope you are all fine. This is the chicken nugget from Dawn Foods and this is the chicken breast nuggets. And here you can see there are 12 pieces nuggets. Um, and there is a how to cook guide. And this is the nutritional value. So basically, uh, what I'm this is, I'm promoting the Pakistani products. As we know that our kids are fond of eating KNNs and all the other products. And instead of using these, we can use the Pakistani products as they are very cheap and compared to them, they are very good and are of great nutritional value. So basically, uh, there is a tip number one that always fry in the less oil and the oil you use, just use it for the twice for frying. And uh, how to cook the chicken nuggets is basically that you have to first heat the oil in the pan up to a minimum level, okay? So this is the level in which you can hear the sounds. When you put the nuggets in the oil, this shows that the oil is perfect for frying. And in this temperature, you have to just fry the nuggets, okay? And the oil I'm not using too much because my whole nugget is not being dipped in the oil. So that is called the shallow fry. And the pan I'm using is literally, literally a small one because I'm using a 1 kg cylinder and this is a very small cylinder as gas load shedding is going on. So this is how you cook the nuggets, okay? This cost only 400 and something and, and the Dawn one is really low in price as compared to the K. And then, and you can see this, we are shallow frying it. And this is a plane we're using. And this is a very small pan with only minimum nuggets we have. And tip number two is that do not give excess nuggets to your, uh, or any frying thing, excess to your kids. Only one or two nuggets per kid, okay? Because frying things just make your kids' throat go worse. And especially in the spring season when there is pollen or wind everywhere. So, as you can see, the wind is blowing. So basically, uh, you just have to make sure tip number three is that uh, the nuggets are not too cold, not that feast if you want them to cook and become crunchy as well. Tip number four is that engage your kids as well as my one kid is standing there on this and the other kid is standing there. Now we got to flip the sides with a light golden brown. We have to flip it. The spatula I'm using is a very kebab spatula to hold the kebabs and this is very little one. So never mind it. And now you can see it's a bit flippy now. It's almost done. Because they are extended and fluffy now. And light golden brown in color. It's better to place a paper towel, kitchen towel, underneath them to absorb the extra oil. As I'm just putting down there because I don't have right now. So, here we go. And tip number five is just place a kitchen towel to absorb the extra oil. Or you can put it in the sieve and then later on. Later on I'm going to shift it in another plate and the oil will, removed, will be removed. So enjoy the meal.